So, so when you got together with your friend, did you do it live in person or did you do it remotely or how did it on Zoom? Work? Yeah, because she lived in California. And so it's all been really remote, how I learned really. I mean, I do some animal communications in person, but at least for me at first, I, I've had to do a lot of work on my own like energetic subtle bodies because I was definitely the kind of person who would take on or take in other people's energy. And so it was something I really had to be aware of like doing animal communication. Like you just, you can't, you can't do that. And oh, I get it. Yes. With the, with the owner that's in, that's present and they already have assumptions, right? Or they already have their energy about it. Right. Right. And even with the animals too, like I could feel like my energy would become a little bit too mergy with, with the animals when I was doing it in person. And it took a lot of effort for me, like at the end of a session to like, okay, I'm separating myself out. And so for me, I, I found that doing it remote, like instead of having the animal there in person, if I was just reading from a photograph, like there was, I didn't have, you know, cause when you're in person with somebody, you're etheric, that energetic level of you is interacting with that other live person or animal that's there, but you don't have that same etheric interaction when you're just reading from a photo. And so for me, that was a really good way to learn. And I was able to learn how to manage my energy a little bit better. So then when I was doing more stuff in person, I was able to energetically hold myself better and not take on the energy from the animals or from the humans. Okay, and, that and makes it's sense. Also, yeah, and it's too, like I find um, if I'm doing a reading in person and the, and the human and the animal are there, sometimes it is like the, there can be an overlapping of the human and, and the animal energies. So right. at least like from a learning standpoint, again, it was easier to learn remotely because then I could just like put the person completely aside and literally like look at the second screen and just focus on the animal. Right. 